Hello there. Welcome into Sage Sunset Healing Tarot. Thank you for being here and I do hope you are doing well in this time. I'm really grateful to have you a part of this journey and that I can get to be here with you. All right. All right, so I'm going to get some general messages out for you because they are general. All of the messages may not apply to all of you, so take the ones that do apply and the rest let them fly. I want to say thank you so much for hitting the like button and for sharing the messages with those you love. Thank you also for being a subscriber. All right, so let's get into this. Wee, 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 wee. Woosha, woosha. So this is this is a love reading. And and right off the bat, we're seeing someone wants to give you something. <laughs> that just took over my reading. This person they feel like they can just pay their way through with a card. Like even in my energy. The f but this says give me some attention and flirt flirtatious flirting with you wants to dazzle you or to impress you so maybe someone wants to impress you with money um right off the bat i'm seeing water vibration plentifully or a good amount of water energy here in your love reading so that looks good at the top here we have the ace of cups which means i feel like you're riding on a you know a solid foundation of love self-love for yourself i feel like you're overpouring in your self-love and i got a hint of asking you just to be careful with that i don't know why to be careful with your overflow of self-love why something about what is in your cup something about balance something about holding your cup firmly your emotions so how you express yourself being t i hear temperate even with your joy so um feelings of reservation when it comes to your full expression containment of your emotions because i feel like don't scatter your emotions so even though it overflows what am i saying i feel like you should contain it more so that you can use it for better when you need to all that love you know what i mean maybe i'm just saying be careful who you're giving your love to because not everyone deserves to usher themselves into your vibration and just shower beneath your waterfall of abundant love here. Nope. It's not everyone should bathe in your shower. I feel like in the past you used to do that a lot. Um, maybe not a lot. Cause it sounds like I'm judging you when I say that. But I feel like you did that easily because you're so open so giving and you felt like it wasn't affecting you but i do feel like you were in that same sense allowing people to forward into your vibration and even murk up your water muddy up your vibration maybe you weren't paying attention to vibration in 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 that period of your life you know it, it didn't mean that you thought you were good but it's almost like your aura, your energy, your vibration was being affected by just allowing certain people to bathe in your abundance of and your overflow of love and givingness. So, you know, I feel like some of the things that you endured was to um, just allow you to have self-esteem, more boundaries, be more solid, more focused, to even become self-aware, more confident, more self-assured know who you are why you are what you bring and why you bring what you bring and so even be more discerning so that you know when other people are coming in your energy that wanna you know just use your fountain of awesomeness and move away because they just want to be you know maybe they just feel 
filthy ASF and they just want to take a shower. They just see this. What? You know, like here, maybe you're just too open. It sounds like I'm judging, but it's just like maybe this fountain is just built. You, It's like this city. Oh my God. Mm -mm. It's a good thing because this is in your past energy, <laughs> the two of cups vibration. <clears throat> so um, I feel like you are surely, 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 surely moving away from a so called so tie a contract that you tied you know a soul contracts connect together um what else does it say it makes sense i don't know i feel like when i said that someone told you it made sense or you were reasoning in your head that it made sense whatever this vow or commitment is that you made prior in your past <laughs> but i also feel like it has something to do with your a union it could be a marriage a home a living situation with the four of wands energy that was a mouthful so i'm gonna re go over these messages again because i just feel like i just said a lot um because there's so much more to say you know i feel like a twist of fate happened it was magical in maybe every sense of that word oh yes and um <clears throat> so i feel like you just oh yes oh yes oh yes something what is that a lot of flowers a lot of flowers a lot of um the energy of flowers feels like the feeling of flowers alive it's like using the power of or the plant fl energy flowers for healing but you're not killing the plants you're just basking in the energy of the plants these could be red and green flowers i don't know it's like sitting in the midst of them these flowers and I feel like someone got their sight back someone got their vision back oh my god <laughs> alright someone got their vision back I feel the king of cups you know when I say I feel like you got your vision back it's almost like there was, you didn't know who you are or a sense of self. And these flowers, there was some enchantment. Many of these flowers are here. I don't know, but you got your vision back. Um, I feel like your heart is clear. Maybe your heart is wholesome once more. It's yours because... Maybe in the past you gave it a part of it too much. As if you thought you had to give a half of your heart to another person. You know, like they make the keychains. You give one person half of your heart. <laughs> and that was deadly, really, to have committed such an act upon yourself. Don't do that. Don't give your heart, your half of your heart to anyone. That will kill you. I feel like so you didn't know who you are till you had to reunite with that other half of your heart, which is yourself. I'm not talking about another person. All right. So there was a, a, a separation, truly, really, 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 really. All right. And it had to happen, my darling. You had to. And this is so divine. It's like a dream I've had, you know. I've like I've it's like I've 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 felt it before because even the hard things I don't want to say it but truly I feel like it's all a design particularly for you to have come like come back home to to your wholesomeness to find your other half of heart 
and I don't know where it's almost like maybe you didn't give it but you felt like it was taken so at you as the king of cups here wholesome I feel like you're ready to maybe move forward in maybe in love once more to trust to follow your heart to meet someone 